earth is divided into different natural regions. These areas have different types of plants, animals and weather patterns. One such region is called the polar region. These are situated near the poles. That is North Pole and South Pole. The countries that belong to the North region are Canada, Greenland, Iceland, Norway, Sweden, Finland, Alaska which is in USA, Siberia region of Russia. Polar regions show extremely colder climate which is covered with snow and remain cold for most part of the year. In this region, the sun doesn't set for 6 months and even doesn't rise for other 6 months. The temperature goes down below minus 37 degrees Celsius during winters. The ground remains frozen most of the year and water becomes available or in during short summer when snow melts. Mosses and short-lived flowering plants grow in these regions. Animals living in these regions are adapted in different ways to cope with the condition of temperature, light, moisture and also availability of food in that region. Polar bear, penguins, whale, seals are the animals that live in polar regions. Some fishes, foxes, musk oxen, reindeer and birds also live in polar regions. Let's take a look at the adaptations in polar bear. Polar bear is a large and white bear that lives in the north polar region of the earth and mainly feeds on fish and seal and can survive in the extremely cold climate of the polar region because they have some special adaptation in their body. As we see, polar bear are white in color. Their body is covered by a thick coat of white fur. It helps them to blend with their surrounding snow white background and cannot be noticed by the predator. Beneath the fur is a thick coat of fat which insulates the body from cold and keep the bear warm. This thick layer of fat beneath the skin also stores food. In winter, polar bear hibernate. So, during that time, this stored food helps the polar bear to survive in the winter. They have a strong sense of smell so that they can locate their prey very easily. They also have small ears to keep the body surface area to the minimum and reduce the heat loss from the body. Polar bear is a very good swimmer. They have wide and large paws that help it to swim. These paws also help them to walk on the snow easily. While swimming underwater, it can close its nostrils and can remain underwater for long durations. Another well-known animal living in the polar region is the penguin, which can survive due to different adaptations. Let's take a look at its adaptations. First of all, these are black and white in color, which merges well with the white background of the snow. Their skin is thick and have a thick layer of fat below their skin which protect them from extreme cold. Their body is streamlined and the wings are flipper-like. They have webbed feet which makes them a very good swimmer. This adaptation also help penguin to catch its prey which is fish. You must have seen or notice that penguin live together in a large number and they huddle together. So why do they do so? The reason of huddling is to keep themselves warm. There are many animals in the polar region that can survive during extreme cold. But birds must remain warm to survive. So they migrate to some other warmer places when the winter sets in and come back when the winter is over. This is called migration. Migration is a seasonal journey taken by different animals or birds to escape the extreme climatic conditions or in the search of food. For example, Siberian crane migrates toward warmer region in the autumn by traveling several thousands of kilometers. They are seen in Bharatpur, Rajasthan 
and Sultanpur in Haryana and sometimes in the wetland of north east and other parts of India. Sometimes these migratory birds travel as much as 15000 km to escape the extreme climatic conditions of their habitat. Hope you enjoyed learning today. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.